guys, this is Nick from HF Survival School, thank you for joining me. Today I thought it would be a great day to go in the woods and try to make fire in wet conditions. I know you will probably think that it is sunny outside and everything is dry, but that is not true. It has been raining for about two days and uh, I came out from the house right after uh, it stopped raining and before I got here sun came out and it is so hot that I am in my t-shirt. But that doesn't change the fact that everything is soaked wet. So first of all I will try to find a dead standing tree which is the uh, best to st starting fire in wet conditions. So guys I have found this dead standing tree which I think will be perfect to start fire. So guys, as you see, our uh, feather sticks are ready. I also found some natural fat wood and now I'll uh, scrape some of it so that it will be easier to start fire. For those of you who wonder what this is, uh, this is a, a Mora scraper. It was made specially for me uh, by Mora and it is uh, only one uh, in the world. I'm just kidding with you guys, no one made a knife specially for me. I just broke a Mora companion and I'm using it as a uh, fair rod scraper. This is why I love fat wood. It starts fire with no problem. So as you guys can see, I, we got the fire going in no time. I only used the materials uh, which I uh, harvested from the uh, dead standing tree and nothing else. Also I found a fat wood uh, on the branch of the uh, tree which we have fallen. So now I will be waiting the fire to go down a little bit and then I will be making a really delicious food. So guys, today I will be making a traditional Georgian food uh, called chadi. Uh, for this you will need corn powder, uh, some kind of oil to put it on the pan so that it doesn't fry and a little bit salt. But uh, too bad I forgot uh, the oil and also I forgot the salt. So this will be the first way making it this way. So it, if it doesn't come out, please don't be mad at me.
but now we are all ready to put this on the fire. I will put the lid on just for a few minutes. I also decided to put coals on the top of it because uh, I don't think the uh, heat only from the bottom will be enough. This is not the traditional way of do doing it, but for the traditional uh, way I needed the oil, which I don't have. So let's see what will happen. So guys, I don't know how much time it has been there, but I think it will be ready. Oh yeah, oh yeah, look at that beauty, oh yeah, it will be so delicious. I don't care about this burnt places, overall it will be just great. So I'll wait a few minutes to let it cool down a little bit and now let's go to the next step. Hmm, what do we have here? Oh, do you think what I'm thinking? Well, if you are thinking about cheese, then you would be right. Now let's take one of our beautiful, delicious mchadis, cut it in half. and put one piece of cheese inside. Mmm, it is so delicious. I wish you guys were here. And do you guys know what is the best part about this? Making a delicious tea after eating delicious food. I will boil some water now and make some tea. So guys, I think that will be all for today. I hope you liked the video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. Also, subscribe to my YouTube channel, it will help a lot. If you want to help my channel, you can help it very much by sharing this video on your social media. Uh, new videos coming every one week, two weeks. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.